So you know exactly what we're going to talk about, the National Science and Math Quiz. In the meantime, we're still hoping that we'll still be able to make some time to have that uh, conversation with parents and teachers. Now, the 2020 National Science and Math Quiz is here again. The London Balloting is just some minutes underway. A total of 108 schools will be pitched against one another in the preliminary stage for a slot at the next round of the contest. 2013 NSMQ winners St. Thomas Aquinas Evans Mensa School and two-time champions in Fantafim School uh, will for the first time begin the campaign from the prelims due to COVID-19 pandemic. The prelims will be held at the various regions and that means the format for this stage has changed. Joining me in studio to help us have a better understanding of how the NSFQ preliminary stage will happen is my colleague Maxola Gbagba. Maxola Gbagba will first tell us what the format for the preliminary stage COVID-19 before COVID-19 uh, and what has changed. Maxola, let's go a bit, you know, down memory exactly. lane. Mm. So take it away. Well, 2019, uh, mm. it was electrified. It was breathtaking. Um, know, right? We witnessed all of that. Um, myself and then Emma Fernandes and Jadosi, we sat through all the concept uh, uh, contest at the University of Ghana Business School. Mm -hmm. And then the grand finale um, was later at the um, Accra um, International Conference Center. Mm -hmm. I mean, at the National Theatre. Great event, wonderful event at the end of the day. Um, St. Augustine's College, they were crowned, you know, 2019 winners uh, of that competition. And we know that um, one name that we cannot forget when it comes to the 2019 National Science and Math Quiz is Newton. Um, Jimmy, you know, <laughs> Stephen Newton, super sub, you know, for St. Augustine's mm -hmm. College. Anytime he came on, he was coming on. You'd hear, I mean, the crowd, the audience screaming, Newton, Newton, Newton. He came on and he did wonders. Mm -hmm. In fact, in 2019 also, we saw what many described as the finals before the finals. Mm -hmm. So there was a contest between St. Augustine's College in Fancy Pim School and then Swedro um, Senior High School. At the end of the day, um, Fancy Pim School, they were kicked out mm. at the last, uh, I think it was the one eighth competition, the last competition they were kicked out. But let's just let's have an idea. Recap, let's yeah. go to 2019. Let's see what it was like in the year 2019. Okay. concerned you are all champions in my books you are all champions but I have to make some distinctions St. Peter's Senior High School you've done very well congratulations but today was tough the Egyptians were too strong mind. You have earned 1,500 Ghana CDs from the GCB Bank Money Zone. Congratulations, third place. Preset Legon, congratulations to you as well. You've done very well. You've done well. Position was great. Nonetheless, you have earned 2,040 Ghana cities in the GCB Bank Money Zone. Well done. Congratulations once again. Second place. St. Augustine's College. Congratulations on winning the contest. You did it. And 2,340 Ghana cities from GCB Bank. Ladies and gentlemen, the new trophy for the National Science and Math Quiz is going to St. Augustine City High School. So that's what happened last year. Maxwell, this year is going to be different. COVID-19 has made the phrase, we're not in normal times, a cliche. Tell mm. us what to expect, what is changing this year? Well, um, in 2019 and in previous years, what usually happens is that you have um, seeded schools 
um, so the seeded schools will come in during the elimination stages of the competition. Mm. But then there will be the preliminary... Help us understand you know, the concept uh, of the seeded schools. So yeah, these the are schools, schools that don't need schools, to go through the preliminary. Exactly. These are schools that do not require to go through the elimination. Because? To, because, I mean, they went past the, um, what do you call it, the elimination stages. They went past the 1-8 stage, I should say, okay. and then, you know, progress right. in the competition. So let's go ahead. With yeah, that. so we have seeded schools, mm -hmm. and then uh, we have um, schools that made it from the regions, all of them coming together at the University of Ghana and then comp taking part, you know, in the competition. Okay. But this time around, what is going to happen um, is that the preliminary round of the competition for the national competition will be happening, you know, um, in the region. So we're okay. happening in, you know, some zones and then regions. So let me just take you through yes. this. This is the preliminary stage. Mm -hmm. And then um, on 8th September, um, we have the competition taking place for the Greater Accra region. On okay. 10th September, it's going to be the Western Zone. 11th September, is going to be the Central region. 10th and 11th September will be the Northern Zone. 14th and 15th September will be the Eastern region. And then 14th and 15th September will be in the um, Buna Ahafu Zone. And then 17th and 18th September will be in the Shanti region. And then 17th and 18th September will be the Volta um, OT zone. So what is going to happen is that the prelims will be taking part, will, will be taking place yes. in these regions or in these zones. The winners from um, the 40 contests um, will then move and then come to um, Accra for the one eight stage, you know, um, of the competition. Okay. So the winners from the 40 contests and then um, the first runner-ups, 14 first runner-ups uh, will be joining the 40 winners and then the 27 seeded schools and all of them will be coming um, together to take part in the main you know competition that's um that will be progressing from the um other stage that i talked about earlier okay. to the next stage of the competition and you will be right there on the ground to give us all the details as and when it happens Maxwell. exactly exactly will certainly be coming to us so um I understand that there is, you oh, need to okay, yeah, us so, the balloting. Yeah, so well. we have port A, port B, port C. Mm. And um, those in port A are those who obtained higher scores during the um, regional competition. Okay. So all those in port A obtained higher scores. Port B, they obtained middle scores, I would say. And then port C, they obtained lower scores. So what will be happening is that today's balloting that will be taking place, um, there will be one school from port A, Second school, Tema Methodist Senior High School, Ganata Saint Margaret, yeah, so, Mary. Exactly. So, Port A, Tema Methodist Senior High School, Ganata SHS, and then my school, Saint Margaret Barry Senior High School, in Port A. <laughs> uh, of course, they, they, okay. they qualified with very high scores, and then Port B, middle scores, um, Saint Thomas Aquinas Senior High School, Evans Benson School, mm. um, Holy Trinity Cathedral, West, West Africa SHS, SHS. MFA School. Yeah. <laughs> in Port C, we have Saint Mary's SHS, Our Lady of Mercy SHS. It continues like that, and then in the Shanti region. Anglican SHS Kumasi, this is a school to watch out for. Cass, great wonders they've been doing, you know, in that region. Mm -hmm. Last year we saw them, and we know that definitely this year they're going to cause, you know, some great upset. Mm -hmm. um, so Adventist SHS, it goes on and on, Port B, Port C. So this is for the Greater Accra region, Ashanti region, and then we can move to the other regions and see what we have for the um, right. other regions. Okay. Central region. Infancy Pim School, yes, mm. Infancy Pim School. That's Chris Chum School. <laughs> yes, that's Chris. <laughs> <laughs> My boss is school, so I would not, not say much about Infancy Pim. <laughs> you know, okay. Infancy Pim School, but mm. we know that um, in the 2019 competition, mm. that was last year's competition, they got kicked out at the one eight stage by St. Augustine's College, mm. and uh, we witnessed that. It was, I mean, it was fun. Ghana National College, we never SHS, we drew SHS. Mm -hmm. Port B, Assistant College, Agri Memorial, Zion SHS. A Palm SHS and Port, Port C. Surprisingly, Holy Child. we have Holy Child School in Port C. You go for Green SHS, yeah, Mass Port in, in there. And then we have the Western Zone, Archbishop Porter Girls SHS, and Sign SHS, Taco SHS, Port A, Port B. We have St. Mary, St. Mary's Boys, Antaman Girls SHS, Bumpe SHS, SHTS, and then Port C, Bia SHTS, and then BBN SHTS for the Western Zone. Let's check out. Um, I think the last zone. The last zone, okay. Okay, there you so have we have the Eastern region, Kofoida Sectec SHS in Port A, Ophiopinion SHS, Asamankasi, Asamankasi SHS, Osino Presby SHTS, St. Martin's SHS, Akuman SHS. Akuman. And then um, Port B, Presby, Presby SHS, Abitifi, Ebri Presby SHTS, Benkum SHS, Adontin SHS, Presby SHTS. And then um, Port, Port C. C. Oyoko. Oyoko. Oyoko, okay. Methodist Oyoko SHS. Methodist. Ebri Girls. Ebri Girls has been replaced with St. Roses. Okay. And then we have Bwakwa State College. 
maybe BM Zion SHS, in Quetia Press BSHS. And then see. Volta Region, Volta Zone. That's the final. Yeah, that's the final. Right. But mm -hmm. here we have Bishop Herman uh, College. Uh, one of our boys is school. Elvis Elvis school. school. <laughs> <laughs> we have Maulis School, Ola SHS, Ebafa Power School, Sigan <laughs> Coffee SHS, and Mary's Seminary SHS, Lulubi, and then Sunrise. Sunrise, remember Sunrise from last two years. Um, Pod B, Zion College, Chito SH. TS, Angno SHS, KJB Asato SHS, Vakmo SHS, and then Pot C, Georgia Penny SHS, Akachi SHS, OT SHS, Boyman SHS, and then okay. Adidome SHS. SHS. So the balloting will be happening um, this evening, um, 5.30 p.m. at the launch. Okay. We'll be waiting to see which of these schools will be paired, which of them will be winning the first runner-ups. They would make right. it um, to the next stage of the competition. Thank we'll you. To Thank you, Maxo. Maxo Lagbaba there. He'll be on the ground to bring us more uh, of that when it happens. But just before we go uh, on a break for sports, DBS, um, after several years of intensive research, DBS Industries Limited brings you Colorlink Plus roofing sheets to help complement your dream house in style. Visit DBS Industries Limited in Accra on the Spintex Road in the DBS building near Papaye Restaurant. You can call them on 0543-286-637 and visit uh, factories in Kumasi, Tamale and Takrade. Also, Bryce Senior High School, our uh, 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 world is a complex one and in it only the smart and intel intelligent win. At Bright Senior High School, Kukren Tumi, we know this and the reason we've deployed state-of-the-art facilities and highly qualified teachers to train and groom the next generation of candidates for our universities and the future. Students are engaged within well-equipped classrooms, computer science and laboratories. That's not all. We've got facilities to ensure quality recreation. So you're called upon to make inquiries on 0277-147-727-0242-071185. Forms are available at GC Bank and Zenith Bank branches across the country.